super excited to be in Cannes. It's an amazing place to be. Beautiful weather. Can't believe I'm here, honestly. Very sunny, very hot. We've seen a lot of the things that we saw last year related to cryptocurrency and metaverse actually evolving into different directions. Chat GPT, augmented reality, mixed reality. This is where creativity comes together every year. From around the world descends on this small strip of land. Brilliant ideas come out of this place. Being new, being different. You're making connections that are important for business. It's not only about the bottom line. Think of Cannes as a place where you can have impact. Because without the impact, new and different, it's just new and different. A good example is uh, the Young Lions competition, which we're here for. They're competing against people from 30 other countries. Print, film, design, PR. We were given 24 hours. We were given a brief. The brief was for the NSPCC, raising awareness of child abuse. An NGO that wanted to raise funds for African kids. Started at 9 a.m. First step, print the brief out. Highlight like hell. It was quite a hefty brief. There were a huge number of ideas. When you're brainstorming, there's a lot of ideas that you just say them and then and then they go. The craziest, wackiest, just insane ideas. I think we kind of expected to go straight in, two hours in, have our idea and kind of go ahead with that. That really wasn't the case. We stayed up round the clock. I know that there were moments where we both felt, to be honest, very discouraged and we felt like we weren't getting anywhere. We talked through them and we just went, makes no sense, call, and we just ripped stuff up. The one that was standing, it was just, it survived. It was the best. It was the best sperm out of everything that came across. And once the baby is made, you take the baby and you run. <laughs> Going into the global competition, um, my partner Mitra and I are both eager to just take as long as we need getting to that idea and really kind of stress testing different ideas. We need to make sure that it's a global appeal that can be quite difficult given that Singapore is a very tiny dot in a very big world. People enter the awards that come from across the world and the smallest agency in the smallest uh, territory can compete with the biggest agency uh, in the biggest market. I love PR. I really, really do. I have a lot of people asking me what is PR and it's hard to kind of explain it. It doesn't always present itself as the most understood or accessible career choice necessarily. The core element of PR, I believe, is communication. And I love communicating. Someone once told me that marketing is paying for publicity. PR is getting publicity without paying. I think it's really important getting diverse people into the industry. They want to join. It's just a matter of the agencies giving the opportunity to young talent. Graduate schemes, internships, any sorts of opportunities. In order to attract, I think we really need to find ways to kind of integrate like trends and like sustainability AI. How can we incorporate it into PR? Creativity means to me being crazy as hell and ballsy as hell. Challenge conventions in a playful way that is likely to deliver impact and make people stand up and stop and recognize, realize, or <laughs> think and feel something. Creativity means to me a way to reach people. Creativity is a combination of culture and objective. Why do we do it this way? Does it work this way? Is there any way we can kind of change it?